I need to feed that. Ooh. What? Hold on. No, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. One second. What? Ah! Hey, I'm Jay from the Cub Scouts. Welcome back to another episode of Bendy and the Dark Revival. We are continuing exactly where we left off in the last episode. I didn't know that this was Baby Bendy or Lil Bendy. Everybody keeps calling him like Baby Bendy. I thought he was just short. Like, I just thought Bendy looked like this all the time, smiling from ear to ear like his shit don't stink. But we are going to open this up. And we're gonna go to the street because you know I'm for the streets. So Bendy is the homie, right? Bendy, yeah, you the homie, right? Okay. So do I follow you or do you follow me or do we follow she? Here we go. Let's inspect this. Looks like we need to find an ID card somewhere around here. Any ideas, Bendy? Hmm. Okay. Acting like you weren't gonna do that the whole time. Shut up. Find an ID card. Can't we just pick him up and scan his ugly face? Nothing I'm just kidding. He's cute. Let's keep looking. All right. There was nothing inside of your home. How about this barrel? Oh, your There's condo? Nope. Sorry, Bendy. All right. Maybe inside of your girlfriend's apartment right here? Yeah. Well, maybe it's somewhere else. Okay. I know Bendy hates me. Bendy definitely hates me. I'm always talking that shit. I can never nothing stop. In here. Let's keep looking. If there's a jump scare in one of these things, I'm returning this game. I don't care. Nope. Not in here. <laughs> Uh-oh. What was that? That didn't sound right. Yeah, the jump scares in the last episode, if you all didn't see it, they were jump scaring. Nope. Not in here. Something's not right. Oh, whoa! My bad. <laughs> bah! Bah! That's cool. I'm not gonna lie, that's pretty cool. Nice. Oh, the future has arrived. I just didn't know it would be here so soon. Some of the stuff that's coming out of Gent doesn't follow any of the rules of physics that I know. Hard to believe they started as a bricklaying company once upon a time. Nowadays, we have all the modern conveniences and worse yet, the headaches. Take that ID card machine they've got at the door. You don't bring your ID, you ain't getting to work. So I started putting my ID card on my nightstand in my room at the Downside Hotel. It's not the safest place, but at least I know where it is. Eugene Lloyd. Looks Shut like up, we found Eugene. A you know I'm going to the Downside Motel. What were you doing in the Downside Motel anyway? Better yet, who were you doing in the Downside Motel? That I need to know. I have a lot of questions and I'm begging for some answers. What? What the fuck? Oh yeah? Oh, yeah? Just start my own place. What? That's not my fault. What? This dude just threw his balls at me? Uh, come here, bitch. Now I'm gonna beat your ass in the streets. Bop. Uh, ugly? Why are you so ugly? Is that Boris? I'm jacking that. Bendy? Oh, mother. Sorry. How do I. Oh. How do I do this? Bendy? How do I get up here? Oh, wait. Duh. Watch this. Boom. Can you do that, Bendy? Bendy? All right. Bendy's going to wait down there. And we are going to take some of that. Ooh, that donut. Though. I'll get you. Thank you for that. Where? Oh, okay. <laughs> gotcha. There we go. Well, geez. You haven't gotten far. Don't do that. Wait. How... How did you get in here? Oh, I have my ways. So tell me, how goes the journey? Slow, but I'll get through. Ah, I see you have your father's never quit go getter spirit. Oh, now you knew my father. Well, newsflash, I didn't even know my father. Yeah, so shut or up. Or my mother. Or anyone else in my family. I see then. You've chosen to forget the past. I can understand that. What are you talking about? Look, I don't think you're ready for this, but hang on to your lunch money. There's something I want to show you. Oh yeah? I didn't even know my lunch money. Stop acting Wait. like you know me. What I don't know doing? anything. I don't even know what day of the week it is. I don't even know what time it is. Bro talking like he really knows me. Dude thinks shit sweet just because right, he has a nice you. mustache. I'm here, I'm here. Let's see what you find when you want me to see. Whoa. All right. Over here. Come have a seat. This won't take long. 
All right, whatever you say, bud. Can't? Can't do that? What do you want me to see? Do you want me to... Oh, you want me to have seats. Where are we? My bad, I'm a bad Very listener. Very old place. Full of memories. But never mind all that. There's a little story you need to hear. You ready? I Here guess. Once upon a time, Audrey... Everybody pay there attention. was a bitter old Pop man quiz after this. who had lost just about everything. Uh huh. Joey. Right. The real Joey Drew. He blamed everyone but himself for his mistakes. What but an mostly asshole, huh? he blamed his old business partner for abandoning their work years and years ago. A man by the name of Henry Stein, <laughs> great artist and a good friend. In his anger. Joey used an evil machine to create another world. Hmm. A world made of paper and ink, where he'd torment his own version of Henry forevermore. Sounds whack. But one day, a miracle happened. An angel came into Joey's life. Oh yeah, was she a, a baddie? A woman by the name of Allison Pendle. She didn't visit often, but when she did, she saw something good in Joey no one else could, including himself. Through their friendship, he began to see the world with better eyes. Bro, in the friend so one day, zone. In Joey's cartoon cycle of hatred, he gave Henry an angel of his own to guide him when things were most dark, to always provide hope. It was then Joey decided to make something new, something he had always wanted but he could never have a family. But not a cartoon one. Something real. And after many, many tries, he created something that made him happier than he ever could have imagined. A wonderful, loving daughter. Many tries, though. Bright, kind, almost human. Ew! He created you, Audrey. Wait, what? I'm not fully human? Crazy? What am yes, I, part dog? I know it's a lot to believe. Who do you think you are? I wasn't born from some machine. Flesh and, and blood. I'm not some kind of ink monster. Just because we're born of darkness doesn't mean we belong to it. Wait, are me and the ink we're demon cuzzies? to choose to believe what we want to believe. Take me back. The ink demon right might be my now. third cousin. I'm not listening to any more of your lies. Remember who you are, Audrey. Leave me alone. <sighs> Bro said, damn, she's not even listening. Let me bring her ass back. But is that a what a twist type thing? Is that what a twist? Or did everybody know it? Because it's apparently with Bendy stuff, everybody's a lore whore with it this game. Be. So everybody knows everything. Like they know the exact height of like Boris, for example. But give me this ID card. Let's get inside that gen building, BB. All right, Bendy. Low Bendy, I'm coming. But before... What? Shut up. But yeah, everybody knows the lore of this game. Bendy? Benjamin? <gasps> oh. Wait! What? What? Hey! Stop throwing those balls at me! Oh, God. Oh, dear. Oh, dear, God. Okay. Oh, shoot. Okay. What is this, man? Come on, give me a chance! Give me a chance, psych! I'm gonna give you a chance. One last chance. Oh, you like that? Who doesn't like that? I think everybody likes that. All right, I have no idea where Bendy is, but I guess we're just gonna proceed to move on without him, even though he was the homie. <laughs> Bendy was the homie. <laughs> is what I would say if I actually cared about little Bendy, but I do though. I do. So <laughs> Bendy, <laughs> I love you. <laughs> we are the keepers. All right. Oh my! Okay. Cool. Oh, see, I told you we might be cousins. Because we're reacting the same. Yo! Hold up. Wait. Uno momento. 
Lil Bendy is the ink demon? Or was the ink demon trying to consume Lil Bendy? Look, Lil Bendy? Lil... Who, who, who the fuck is that guy? What? Hold on. What did I just see, everybody? What did these two eyes just see? It's either the ink demon consumed Little Bendy with the ink, or they're foreshadowing that Little Bendy is the ink demon. And I am very, very confused. I don't like to ask questions. I believe everyone's got their own business. You hear something, you leave it alone. But when you spend as much time in and out of a chug as I have, you learn to keep your mouth shut about things, you know? So when I saw this here Adam in the newspaper that reads, huh. Gent Corporation looking for research subjects there pays might be a code. 350 a week. I figured it'd be good for me. Easy money, right? With my record, you can't afford to be picky. I think this audio log has a code. Something really wrong is going on in this place. I mean, I've seen dead people before. But here, death is like a way of life. A clockwork march. They wheel out the bodies and they disappear down the chute. Forgotten men from the street. Paid to die. Three fifty a week. Okay. It's not three fifty, is it? Let me see. It can't be. Cause I don't think that there's a zero. Yeah. Alright. I got you, I got you, I got you. So now we need to think outside the box. But before we do that. Let me see if I can get some upgrades. I can't. I need one more of those things. All right. Well, let me take my broke-ass pipe back. And let me see if I can find a code. Hold on. What does that say? Little Devil Darlin'? That's what they call me. What? 523? That's got to be it. 523. Why would you have that there? That is the dumbest thing ever. Like, a thief could look at that. A blind person can see that code. Let me in. Okay. I thought something. Yep. You know that breath is hot. That's creepy. That voice is really unsettling. I don't like that. Sure Can you stop it? Let's just talk. Who are you? I guess I'm going through here. Where did you come from? Who made you? What is this? Twenty one questions? Come on. Can you take me to him? He wanted me to find him. I know what to do. Let me have my pipe back, please. Bam! Alright. No more, no more, no more, no more, no more. Okay. Let's just keep going this way. Now let's figure things out. That voice was actually really creepy. I hate things that sound like that. Ooh! Pencil in 
a dream? What the hell was that thing with all that ass? I don't like this. I do not like that. What? Is... Oh, what the heck? Looking like demonic little mermaids. I'm gonna go back in here. Okay. So they don't have feet, but they have cables that look like tentacles. So what in the tentacle hentai am I getting myself into? I have no idea, but I think I kind of like it. I kind of like it and I'm kind of just like, yo, I don't want to deal with this right now. But if somebody's going to have to deal with it, might as well be me, right? All right. Let's go this way. Run. Woo! Good thing that person is a slow-ass bitch. I'll take that money. Yes. What? No. Really? Go, 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 go. Shit. Oh no, somebody's here. Nope, nope. I'm not gonna get caught, everybody. I'm not. I can't. Not, not in this lifetime. Not in this lifetime. What is this? Card exchange? I don't want to do that. That thing is gonna jump out at me. And it's gonna make me hit high notes. Never mind. Yes. Yes. I'm doing it for the fireman. I'm doing it for the fireman. Fuck yeah, mate. Alright. Goodness. Don't tell me I have to pull another lever. Yay. Cycle breakers? All right, I'll yum. Aye! That's where the ghosts live, just beyond that door. The keeper's prison, the pit. No one ever comes out. At least, they're never quite the same. But I could open the door for you. I do know how. I really do. Ah, uh, thank you. That would. But but first, maybe play a game. Oh, I love to play games. I like hide and seek best. Find me and I'll open the door for you. I promise. Look away while I hide and no peeking. <laughs> really? That, that's what we're doing? We're playing hide and seek when my life depends on this? All right. So let me charge my little pipe. Because you never know when I'm going to need this. Actually, it's already charged. Okay, so I'll keep that there for future future events but i need to find that person great while that thing is hunting me perfect just freaking perfect i think i have to get up there how though can i send this dude to the shadow realm will he get tickled if i touch his tentacle let me see oh god wow okay okay oh that was my bad. I thought I could banish him to the Shadow Realm, but he just reverse Unoed my hell out. Oh, here we go. Accidental greatness. Oh, shit. Whoops. I am going to go up this ladder. I hear the person giggling. All right, lost one. About to find you. How do I do that, though? Oh, wait. wait, 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 wait. I get it. I know where you are. I have to warp onto these things and then go up there. Bada bing, bada boom. Watch this. Yep. This guy one hits you. Alright, one, two. Wait, that's definitely where I go, right? Or maybe I go right here. Let's see. What? I heard the giggling here. Hold on. What is this? You're right there. Are you kidding me? Oh, you did it. You found me. Oh, this is so exciting. You were brilliant. 
Oh, trust me, I was the opposite of brilliant. Open that door for me. Yes, the door. I think you'll find it's open now. Oh, and also, let me give you something. Cool, thanks. Can I have that ribbon that you have? Sweet. Fast travel. Interact with linker pipes to fast travel between two specific locations. Dark places you've already been may hold new secrets. What was behind is now ahead. Cool. All right. See you later. Let me see. Fast travel. That's actually pretty freaking cool. Yeah, that's smooth. I like stuff like that. I can't really choose though. Huh. I thought I could choose where I want to go. I'll go back though. I want to go back to where I was because we need to proceed. We need to find little Bendy. We need to find out who we are. And I think we need to clap the ink demon one time. Because the ink demon definitely needs some clapping right now. But yeah, let's see. This is not where I go, right? It is. Kinda. I think. Yeah, I've never been here in my life. I've never seen this shit in my damn life. Can't go in there. The keepers have taken my friend. Locked him away like some animal. Just because he's big and strong. But they do not need to fear him, no. If they just make sure to feed him on time, Big Steve won't ever hurt a fly. He loves the food from the Little Devil Lounge best. If only someone would take the long road back through the sewers, climb up the elevator shaft, and seek out his favorite thumping delicacy, then they would see how harmless he really is. Okay, so we need to go to the Little Devil Lounge, and then we need to take the long road back through the sewers, climb up the elevator shaft, bada bing, bada boom. Let's get to it. Hold on, everybody. Let me do this, and then I do... Boom! What am I going to upgrade, though? Let's see. I think I'm going to upgrade... No. kind of want to upgrade my health. Sorry. Rope. Okay. Let's go. That's, that's a big boy. <laughs> that's a big boy, huh? Um, I'm going to go back. I'm going to get you your favorite treat. And then we are going to see how nice you really are. Yeah, see you later. All right, we definitely don't want that smoke right now. So we need to go back. We need to go to the Little Devil Lounge. Climb up the elevator shaft after we go to the sewers. I didn't forget, everybody. I know sometimes it feels like I'm very forgetful, which is true. But this time, you know, especially when that big dude was looking right at me like that, I think that I can remember where we're going because I definitely don't want to die. So Little Devil Lounge. Where would that be? Hey, asshole! Where's the Little Devil Lounge? Yeah, you! Bah! Bah! Mm. Just upgraded my health, bitch! Think I'm scared? I got hits for days. I got hits on hits. Uh, bring that back. I know you stole that food. Get over here. Yeah, your soul is mine, bitch. What's this? Oh, wait. <laughs> back to back? Oh, yeah. Ooh. Okay, this time we are going to upgrade our ability. Everybody thought I missed out on that, huh? I almost did. Let's do ability. If only someone would take the long road back through the sewers, climb up the elevator shaft, and seek out his favorite thumping delicacy, then they would see how harmless he really is. Do I really have to backtrack that far? Because I remember us going to the elevator, but now we got to go up the elevator shaft. Is that right? Is that right? All right, let me beat that ass. Is that right? Why can't I go through here? Oh! Where do I hide? Oh! That was so freaking scary. You're lucky your voice sounds so hot. I'm mesmerized by that voice. That bass gets me jumping every time. Okay, so now we have to worry about the ink demon again. So we're definitely going the right way. Because I don't think the ink demon will be coming if we were going the wrong way. So let's go through. Let's go back. I can't believe we have to go back. How do I do that? There's like some sparkly shit. Hold on. Guys, calm down. Calm your freaking titty sprinkles. 
Yes! Okay. Gotcha! Holy crap. So I was supposed to do it like that. Alright. Bam! And then we have to climb up this freaking elevator shaft. How am I gonna do this, though? Um, wait. Oh. Hello. What is this? What in the world is this shit? Climb? Oh, yeah. I love secrets. Isn't that right, Bendy? I have no idea what I'm doing, but I'm doing things. The doer is doing. Memories are stored in the pause menu. Okay. Memories are stored in the pause menu, you say? Alarm clock. An alarm clock to count the precious hours of each day. There's not much time, so every second together is special. What is that, a message from a fortune cookie? All right, right here, I think. Okay, got that. Almost there, everybody. Holy crap. I need to feed that. <gasps> what? Hold on. No, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. One second. That's not fair. The whole thing went away. That's... That's not right. There's some things in this world that are right, but that's not one of them. Wait a minute. This is where the giggling girl was actually supposed to let me through. What was that other door that I went into? Really? I guess I was trying to go a different way. That's interesting. Deep six required beyond this point. Oh, wow. I was going the wrong way the whole time. What was I supposed to feed that guy, though? Maybe I do that in the future or something. That was random. Subject 414. That's nothing. I am bamboozled right now. I actually thought I was going the right way. I was feeling proud of myself. Cool. <gasps> That's cool. I think I need the lo-fi version or the bass boosted version. Let's see where else we can go. I didn't even know that there were switches for these things. There you go. See? I knew I was missing things. This is why people complain in the comments. I miss the most simple things. Um, excuse me. Sir? Can you help me? You must be really lost to be asking me. I'm just looking for answers about the Keepers, Wilson, the Cycle. Anything could help. What's your name? Audrey. What's yours? Honestly, I've almost forgotten. <sighs> My name is Henry. Have you been a prisoner long? The Keepers think you're a threat to their plans. They lock you away. Well, let me bust Forever. you out of here. Stand Still, back. Give me time to think. I'm gonna break that glass. I'm gonna go. Like bah! 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 I'm kidding. I'm not about that. Human. Why would you be a threat to them? I'm what they call a cycle breaker. Once upon a time, I knew how to start the cycle over. And when that happens, everything begins again. Completely new. I don't trust anything in this world. And the keepers don't want that to happen. How did you do it? Reset the cycle. Turns out the ink demon himself is the key. This world is his. But even he must obey its rules. For now at least. If you can get him to look at something very specific, he will reset everything. What is it? It's just a reel of film. Labeled with the words, the end. I can see it in my mind every day. They keep it upstairs in the pit. I'll see if I can break in and steal it. Maybe if I reset the cycle, we could make things better for everyone here. 
And what about you? I just want to go home. So did I. Good luck, Audrey. If you need me again, you know where to find me. Well, you're definitely not going anywhere. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh shit. Oh shit. That's creepy. We have to find that reel of film called The End. That's exactly what your boy is gonna do. Let's see. There's always hope. Yeah, there is. As long as I'm around, there's always hope. What did you think was gonna happen? Who's trying to smell my asshole stink? Yep, definitely. So, the sense of smell is so great that you knew exactly where to grab me. And then I guess if you're trying to smell your way around, that means you're blind as dick. So, huh. How did that happen? A savior comes at last. I like the voice acting in this game. Wilson? Yes, dude. Yourself, Audrey. You're still weak. The keepers can be relentless to strangers. But there's nothing to fear as long as I'm with you. You're safe now. You're the you one who got me into this mess, old man. You brought me here. Turned oh. me into this this thing. This doesn't make sense. I've never done anything to you. Open your eyes and look around you. None of this makes sense. Drawn walls, nightmarish creatures, an ancient studio that died out almost 30 years ago. It's all fiction, utter nonsense. And yet, in here, What's in a bag, it baby? Exists. It breathes. Is that the the film? It flourishes. Reality, guided by its master's pin, the foundation for a new reality. We can I wanna see. bleed into our own. Just think of it. Anything we create in here, we can release. That's that good stuff, Out huh? There. That's that type of stuff you roll up and smoke but a couple first, times, huh? This world must be controlled. Made safe. These things. <laughs> That's pretty cool. These angels and demons. Hi. Are they really life? Or are they just stains? Old mistakes. Ready to be cleansed away for newer, greater things. What do you want from me? I need your help to save my father's life. Your father's still alive? Bro, you're like 80 years old. How this old is, is your dad? Star. Like, We'll talk more Jesus. once we're safely inside. You want me to help you save your dad? Your dad really looks like he's nut dust. Chapter 5, The Dark Revival. Okay. I kind of want to continue a little bit, everybody. But this dude wants me to save his dad? You look like a grandpa already. What you mean you're dead? Make it make sense. Give me my pipe. Stay close. This place isn't as safe as it once was. Got you, got you. Signal towers are nearby abilities that have been disabled? Huh? Okay. Hello. Are you good? A word? Okay, talking that trash to me. I understand. The demon's evil continues to spread. This world has become a shadow. Be quiet. Oh, voice. Huh. Did you say nothing? What did I say? I said his voice was. Whew, huh. You want me to say it a third time? Because I will. There. 
Just I'm in full admiration. Won't take but a moment. Of course, right? Of course you put me in here. Checkpoint. Weapons are not allowed beyond this point. Please place all... What? What? I can't read to my people? The subject will stand in the designated location. Whoa, mother... Oops. The subject will submit all weapons for further screening. Okay, you don't have to yell at me. It's not like you're dying, bro. It's not like a cat in heat. Where do you want me to submit my weapons? All right here. Oh, freaking Tommy gun? Who had the frying pan? What is this? A 70s cartoon? Somebody had an axe. Still for Do you need a glass of water, my boy? Who had the Tommy gun, though? Can somebody get this man a Happy Meal or something? Is for Thank you. Gracias. All right. You have a little ink coming out of your... And out of your... Okay. I wish I could say I invented them, but it seems our friends at the Gent Corporation had a demon problem of their own long ago. Oh, word. So, exactly how old is your dad? Because I'm pretty sure that he's nut dust right now. Hello, ma'am. Ugh. What is this? And now, my dear... If That's a cool painting behind me, him. I have a lot to prepare. We'll talk later. I promise. Besides, you must be very tired. A quick rest will do you good. I'm okay. Betty will show you to your room. She's my housekeeper, among other things. You never actually killed the ink demon, did you? No. He's too powerful to destroy. So we sealed him away, trapped him in a different form. One that was smaller, harmless. Bendy. It was a fitting prison, although he seems to have found a way to free himself. Ah. But enough talk. We'll deal with that soon enough. There's some nice fresh blankets all laid out for you. You'll be dreaming in no time. Thank you. Wait, Wilson, one more thing. If you needed my help, why didn't you just ask? <sighs> Would you have believed me? Not with a voice like that. Come along, and no more dawdling. I'm this not dawdling, now. whatever that means. Isn't this a bit of an ego stroke? To have a painting of you holding a sword, fighting off some ink demons with light coming through, like you're from the heavens or something? I'm just saying, lady. I'm just saying. Oh, you're it's so exciting finally having you with us. Yeah, for sure. Same. Now, to give you some bearings, we're currently standing in the south wing. Wilson's laboratory is downstairs. And then there's the north wing. What's that, the north wing? Why does that sound so depressing? Tell me, please. The ink demon got in there a while ago. And ever since, we've had to keep the north wing locked up tight. Gotcha. I'm it's fallen into ruins by now. Books gone to waste. Only keepers go there these days. Oh, and they'll tear you apart oh, and leave if Wilson isn't with you. So, mind your distance, and you'll be just fine. Sure, no problem. Wow, this is a fancy place. This is a little too fancy for me. You know what? I'm gonna keep myself humble, and I'm gonna sleep on the floor tonight. To look after, especially one I can actually talk to. Almost everyone here either can't speak or they're completely mad. Girl going like 0.2 miles a minute. Can we wrap this up? I have the world right. to save. Here we are. Best room in the house. Whoa. Okay, you weren't lying. You should see where I sleep. Ugh. <laughs> but this room. Oh, just perfect. It's not bad. I saw to every detail. Bed is clean. The bathroom is on the left. 
Sorry about the stains. I did try my best to get them out. Why are there stains? Actually, you know what? It's better if I don't know. But yeah, I was going to talk shit about the room, but it actually looks pretty nice. I'm not going to lie. Gilson? Wait. For sleeping draft, pinch of salt, cocoa powder, chamomile, soybeans, Gilson. Mix everything in a glass and then drink with exactly three sips of water? Oh. Okay, what do you want me to do? The mug and the maiden? I'm not reading that. You got me messed up if you think I'm reading that. Do you want me to give you a kiss goodnight? Oh. Did you have any questions? Is it always night here? It's always dark, if that's what you mean. For as long as I can remember. Are you very old? No. As far as I understand it, I'm something quite new. Although, I didn't turn out the way I was supposed to. One in a long line of failed experiments. But Wilson will keep trying. And do you trust Wilson? <sighs> this is the realm of the Ink Demon. The shadow hangs over us all. I don't trust anyone. Same. But High five. Wilson takes care of me. Keeps me safe. He once said I remind him of something he called his... Mother? Tell me, is that a good thing? Where you two are from? Yeah. I'm not sure. Oh. I well, I say I yeah. Had one. Well, no matter. Now... I was told to make sure you get some sleep once you got here. So get nice and comfy and relax. I left something on the table that might just help you nod off. It's my own recipe. Works very fast. Just follow the instructions. Carefully. Thanks, Betty. Of course. If you need anything else, I'll come straight away. I'm always up. Why do I not trust anything? Is that just me having trust issues? Because I don't trust anything in this game. Gilson. Find a Gilson. Gilson. No idea what a Gilson is. What's that? Oh. Interesting. I don't want to do that anymore. Gilson. 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 Okay, let's think about it, everybody. What in the world is a Gilson? This seems creepy. Can't go in there. Is there a Gilson in here? Ah. Why do I feel like I'm in a prison? Oh! I guess I just took a fat shit. Well, I'm fully almost ink demoned. Gilson? Hello? <laughs> I do not know where the Gilson is. I guess we don't believe in hand washing in this world. Because I'm just gonna let the stink... Just come out through my fingers. Gilson. Yeah, everybody, I have no idea where the Gilson is. Oh, but I can go around here. All right, let's see. Gilson fish. So I'm looking for fish. There's gotta be one here somewhere. Yeah. What's this? Laboratory. What? That's an old school method. I swear, Wilson Too loves fast. hearing himself talk. I... Oh. Okay. You want me to play something? Maybe if it was closer. Oh, okay. I knew I had to play something. 
But I don't know what this has to do with the fish. That did it. Looks like the fish is asleep. Really? Gilson falls asleep to that whack-ass piano playing? You can't get away from me, little stinker. <clears throat> oh. Uh, hello. I, uh, uh, forgot the Gilson again, didn't I? And there's some already ground up in the kitchen, too. Uh, um, I'll be, uh, I'll, I'll bring it up to your room straight away, shall I? <laughs> oh, and, uh, maybe you could put Harold back in his tank. He does so hate the dry air. Sorry about that. And I didn't mean to call you a little stinker. But we have to return to our bedroom. She's the one that forgot the Gilson. Why are we getting punished for that? You know what I mean? Like, why are we getting punished for something that somebody else forgot? That's the story of my life. Getting blamed for things that should be blamed on other people. But you know what? I'm gonna get ready for bed. Ew. Now, just three sips of water. One. One. Are we going to bet money that we're going to see something after the third sip? Y'all want to shake on it? Let's shake on it. We're going to see something weird. Three. You all owe me money. Watch this. Yuck! Told you. Give me my money. There's so much double crossing in this game. It's like triple crossing, quadruple crossing. She's not adding up. <laughs> like everybody is backstabbing each other. We must all have knife wounds in our back. Get last. I was almost afraid you'd miss my party. What? What's going on? Oh, it seems you're just a little overwhelmed. It's all right, honey. I understand. It's not every day one gets to bask in the glory. solve my little puzzle and return to your special chair. Then, I'll throw this heavenly switch here. If you get the puzzle right, you walk away. Alright. Get it wrong. You fry. Sounds good. Okay. Now what? I'm confused. The bird won't have anything to do with the rabbit, but I hear he likes to court danger by sitting next to the fox. The fox thinks the rabbit smells of elderberry. I couldn't see them sitting together. So I have to figure out which animals are going to sit by who at the dinner table. The fox has always hated the bear. They never sit next to each other. My friend the bear always sits next to the bird. After all, they went to school together. The fox thinks the rabbit smells of elderberry. I couldn't see them sitting together. 
The rabbit never sits with the bird, but he loves the playful company of the bear. Okay, so the bear is going to sit in the middle, and then the, the rabbit, never sits with rabbit the bird, is going to be on one side, and then the fox is going to be on the other side. Of the bear. Or the rabbit's going to be on one side, the bird's going to be on the other side. Oh. The puppet fox? Oh, he, he wouldn't be caught dead sitting on the left. Far too pedestrian. Okay, I got you. So how do I do this? So I guess we have to go up here and then we have to rearrange everybody, right? Oh. Interesting. Okay, so the fox wouldn't be on the left. Let's see. The bear. And then the bird. Where's the bird? And then the rabbit. I think. Let me see. The rabbit. And then the fox. The fox definitely has to be there. But let me see something real quick. Bird, bear, rabbit, fox. But I don't know yet. I don't know yet. I just have to make sure that I'm doing this right. So I'm going to talk to them one more time. And let's see where I messed up. The puppet's fox? Well, he, he wouldn't be caught dead. Okay, so that left. means he's on the right. Far too pedestrian. Got you. The rabbit never sits with the bird. But he loves to play for company okay, of the bear. So I was right with the the bear being in the middle of the bird and the rabbit. The fox thinks the rabbit smells of elderberry. I couldn't see them sitting together. Got it. I know what to do. So I pretty much got it all set up. But I need to switch these two. So bird and rabbit. Boom! Did that not work? What did that do? I think it worked. I couldn't even get a cha-ching! Or like a bum ba da bum Alright. Guess not. Let me have my seat. Hold on tight, honey. Here it comes. No. Three, two, one. I am so sorry, but I'm the freaking man! Let's go! Woo! You know what I do? I'm like that. That's why I'm that dude, baby. Alright. That was good. That was good. Oh, my mother! Wow! Okay. Alright. Damn! They came back from the dead for revenge? It's like that though? Who else? Come here. Wait. Wait. If if they were and then you were but then I was and then they Who the hell were those people? But yeah, we just ran into Alice Angel and oh boy. Whoa, what the That's where the Tommy gun went. No one an angel. No one. I did. I wanted that Tommy gun. Okay. So we have to beat somebody with a Tommy gun. All I have is a pipe wrench. This is an L. I'm a walking L. Where are you? Oh! Okay. Um. Let's see. Let's go here. Got it? Okay. So we're going to have to use our warp powers for good. Good thing we have that. But I'm pretty sure she has God aim, right? Fook. Okay. I need a fully charged gent pipe. I've had enough of her with that OP ass Tommy gun. So let's put that in there. Yoink. And let's get it, ladies and gentlemen. What's this? What the hell did I just do? Active? Huh? Okay. What door is that? I have no idea what the hell I just did. That's where I gotta go. Okay. Now I just need to figure out how to get there. Hold on, hold on. 
Let me be great, Alice. Let me be great. Come out wherever you are. I need to get that down. Oh shit. Okay. Um. Where do you think you're going? Here's what we're gonna do. Here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna go back. I have to make her shoot that shit. Don't I? I think that's what this game wants me to do. I have to make her shoot that whole thing down. So I can go on it. Unless I'm tripping. Maybe this is all scripted, but I think I have to make her aim to where the boxes are. And then knock it on the floor. Am I even making any sense right now? I don't know. Find out right now. Hold on. Let's see. Let's see. Got it. Okay. Come on, come on, come on. Comfort coffee? Ben slugs. Whatever. That's it. Please. Okay, I was supposed to do that. Hi. <laughs> I didn't think that she was gonna look at me like that. Okay, so that thing is gonna fall. So I had to hit the switches on you bitches. Got it. Okay, let's get it. Let's get it. Here we go. Table for humming up. Do I do a sneak attack? There's no way she could see me, right? Yeah. Here we go. Here we go. Banishing on Shadow Realm. Why that made me jump? Final curtain, baby. Let's blow them away. Respectfully, of course. <gasps> my face. It really be your own. You have my face. It really be your own sometimes. Our face. Moral of the story. Can't even trust yourself. Beautiful. And then she's like, ugly. Always were. Conceited, are we? It's poetic in a way. I dig it. Why does this feel so familiar? Hey, who's behind you? Are you all right, Audrey? Alice. Oh, I Boris? Begin to my love. How good it is my to king. See you. My ruler. And this must be your wolf. Audrey, meet Tom. Tom? He's my protector. I thought it was friend. Boris. You both got here just Who's in time. Who's Tom? Now I, I don't know what Tom. You don't like being called Alice. The machine creates many of the same forms. At least on the outside. What the fuck is the Tom? Inside, we're all pretty different. Well... From now on, I'm going to call you something other than Alice. It just doesn't suit you. Oh? What do you have in mind? How about... Allison? It's not bad. Alice, Alice, okay. um... Okay, I'll try it. How about Corny? But How about that? Only if you can tell me what in heaven's name you're doing in Wilson's retreat. Wilson, I almost forgot. I have to get back right away. Are you crazy? Wilson's our enemy. Do you even know him? Have you ever talked to him? I've seen what he's done. That's good enough for me. Look, it sounds like he has a plan to kill the Ink Demon. For good. And I think he can help us all. I just... I just need to go back and hear him out. Well, if it's true, you'll both need as much help as you can get. The Ink Demon won't go down without a fight. Tom and I will gather some of our friends. Who's Anyone that? Else? Good luck, Audrey. Tom! You too, Allison. What do you mean, Tom? Place. Yo, can I... Can I have that? I want the Tommy. You can have Tom, I'll get the Tommy. It's nothing like petting Boris, though. Boris had better pets. He really did. And his tail wagged. What about your shit? 
You don't even have one! Man, whatever, Tom. I'm not even gonna call him Tom. I don't know you like that. Okay. But anyway, they took my Tommy gun. I was actually kind of excited about that. Beautiful people run this world. If you can have brains or talent, you may just sneak through the gates. But with a pretty face, every door opens. The crowds bows to you. They ask your name. They want you to attend. They ask you to speak. A silky voice with gorgeous lips is everyone's weak spot. I was reborn with my perfection stolen from me. To get it back, I'll rip this rotted world apart. Angels are beautiful. Angels are beautiful. Alice Angel. You're right about that, Alice. But you're too obsessed with your looks. It's what's deep inside that counts. But where's the- Oh! Peace. I was just gonna say, where were you? Must they bring us only more Bro, that voice. That voice is something else. Woo -hoo -hoo. It's getting hot in here. That's, uh, oh boy. That's something that I'm not gonna get involved with. Or should we? Oh shit, never mind, never mind, never mind. I thought I was able to hide. Goodness. I do not like that. Oh, nice. Hey. It's been years and my face is still a mystery to my co-workers. They don't know oh. me. They avoid me as if I carried some infectious disease. At first, this was an insult. But now... I can go completely unnoticed, hidden amongst the shadowed walls, Oops. as a clerk, an artist, producer, or even a lowly janitor. <gasps> okay. Um, close your eyes, everybody, because that is just like, ugh, it's too much. Are you coming? You are coming. You are coming. Okay. You come, I go. This thing cannot be killed, but it one hits you. Gives it at one piece without a drink. Alright. Okay, okay, okay. One. And uh, two. And uh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, damn. That thing's slimy. Okay, let's go. Let's go, let's go. What is that? Peak? I didn't even know we could do that. Fuck. Cannot- WHAT THE- f BRO! That's so stupid! I'm dead. I'm dead. God! That's so dumb. Before we do that, I need to do a little bit of this. And we need to hurry up. Because for some reason, you can't hide even when they see you. I guess it makes sense because they know where you are. So it's smarter that way. But it's not something that your boy is used to. I guess this game is on another level. Oh, hey! Okay, I didn't even know that thing was right there. And it moves so slow, too. Hurry the hell up, you son of a bitch. There we go. Time for me to yank. All right. Another note. Dear Alice, I don't know if you will read these notes, but I'll keep leaving them for you. I hope someday you'll understand my words and the madness will fade from your mind. In this strange and dark place, we can find light and purpose. We are not left to wander alone, craving beauty, power, and other meaningless things. Even the heart of someone feeling incomplete can discover joy. We're not lost. We're merely waiting to be found. We are so much alike, formed from the same mold. We're like sisters, you and me. I wish you comfort and the wisdom to let your heart melt into happiness. I won't give up trying to reach you before it's too late. A friend. Huh. What is going on here? This music box could make a good distraction if I can fix it. Alright, so I just need to find like a little handle. Need to find a little lever. Okay, I can do that. Stop boohooing. Chin up. Let me get some of these. Thank you. Okay. 
I need to find a lever. But this is going to be easy because I'm pretty sure it's just going to... Damn it! I thought I was just going to be in this area. Never mind. Another note. They said he killed my lord. They said the ink demon fell. They said I was a false prophet. But I say my lord lives. But I say he will return. But I say you better watch your back, Mr. Wilson. Can I get an amen? Um, no. We cannot get an amen. But we can get a couple hallelujahs. Can I get a couple hallelujahs in the house? Oh my god! Go! I'm dead. 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 Oh. Oh. Let me see if this person turns to the left, please. For me. Come on. Come on. Yes. 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 Fabulous. Perfect! Okay. Whew. That's what I needed to do. And we got a battery might. So what do I do now? Do I have that in my inventory? I don't know what to do. I think I gotta go back to that one spot with that little alien. Okay. Let me see if I can make my way back. What the hell is this? Hide? I don't wanna hide. Wait, why don't you hide? Okay. Um, I'm gonna run. That's what I'm gonna do. Watch this. Got it. Bro, that's clutch. That sucks when you don't have feet, huh? Um, what? How did that happen? I don't know how that happened. That thing was not doing that earlier. Okay. So weird. I guess I go in here. Do I have the music box set up? I don't know. Ah! Okay, I think we go in here. Please, do not get me. Damn it in. Yoink that. Please tell me they didn't hear that. They go by smell, right? Please tell me they don't smell that ass. Or do they? They might. But I hope not. Okay. <gasps> Uh-oh. Shit. Come on, man. Stop. Stop. It's telling me I need to go over there. <gasps> oh, shit. Okay. Get that. Ooh. Batteries, mate. All right. Goodness. Give me that. That's all the pieces for the music box. Fix the music box. It's telling me exactly where to go. So this game is idiot proof. Meaning me. Because, you know, I can't possibly mess this up. There you go. Fixed. Find a now spot I to just place the music box. To oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, oh, oh. Dude, how? How do you have that range? Dude, smack me on my ass a couple times. All right. So let's put you here. Here goes nothing. We gotta hide. How many are gonna go there? Three? I think so. But let me make sure. I know there's three people, but maybe it's only alerting the people that are in the main room. Right? Okay. Please, please. Okay. Holy shit. Wait. Are you freaking kidding me? What does that say? Full charge jet pipe mother. Okay. So, let's do this. There you go. And then... Hit that one time. And then we did it. Right? What the heck? Hide? <laughs> I don't like it when they scream like that. It's kind of creepy. Please hurry up. You dummies. You freaking morons. 
Hurry up! Man, you two are lame. There we go. Okay, hurry up. Joint. Get it. Finally! Yes! Okay. Now what? Anything interesting? Nothing? Where are we going? South wing. Oh! Hello! Did you miss me? I hope you did. There you are. Thank goodness. Wilson's waiting for you downstairs in the laboratory when you're ready. But first, can I get your help with something? What's that? Normally, I wouldn't ask this of a guest, but oh, with all that's happening, I can't sneak out and get things like I usually do. Do you think you could pop round to the farmer's market back in town and find me a few ingredients? We're running quite low in the kitchen. And I was hoping we could all celebrate tonight with a lovely supper. Won't take but a moment if you go by train. Up to you. <laughs> no pressure. You got me messed up if you think I'm going to do that. When you need to travel, take the train. Catch the subway when you need to travel between Wilson's Retreat and downtown. The next train is always on time. You know what? That tea you made me take, or whatever that special concoction was, it almost got me killed by a Tommy gun. So no thank you. I need to go meet up with Wilson, right? I've definitely never been down here. <gasps> Ooh, colors. Wilson. What the fuck? Wilson knows your purpose. The man who killed the ink demon? Why are you lying on your own name, bro? Wilson. Come on, this ain't funny no more. Basically, you're telling me this is the big kahuna, huh? The grand finale. The bada bing bada boom. Alright. I'm ready. Thank you for coming all this way. The ink demon is a formidable foe. To truly destroy such a monster, he must be dethroned. Humiliated. For months now, I've been working on something that will do exactly that. Cast out the demon and put a new deity in his place. Stronger, more powerful, and controllable. Together, we just need to unleash our ultimate weapon. Come, let me show you my creation. Isn't he beautiful? Simple, but elegant. A treasure. Powerful beyond anyone. Sure. The ink demon will fall. And we can have peace at last. It could work. But it sounds risky. What about that How real? We control him? The one that we says the end. Joy's mistake. No, we don't. All the factors must be perfect. The right design. The right science. And... The right You're gonna push me in. Right. At last your purpose is revealed, Audrey. Kick him in there, this please. This is why you're here. With your soul inside him, my creation will live forever. Stay away from me. Kick you're him. Insane. Come now, Audrey. Part He's an old man. He's a senior citizen. Back. Kick him Leave in the thing. Yourself behind. Kick him in the balls at Listen. least. I thought you said we needed to save your father. Man, move us out, Audrey. Let me kick him in the balls. To make everything right. I lied. My father Thought is beyond hope. Perhaps you know him. Nathan Arch, owner of Archgate. Industrial genius. Business tycoon. For years, I've lived in his reaching shadow. He always had time for the grand creatives of the world. The doers, as he called them. He knew only the best, the biggest thinkers. How could his lonely son ever hope to compete with that? But now, thanks to you, I can. No need to struggle. 
My signal prevents you from using those devilish powers of yours. And more importantly, keeps the ink demon from getting in. It's time to die, Audrey. And live again as a god. Wow. Yep. Please. Yeah, kick him in there. Not this time. Yeah, you freaking moron. Wait a sucker. Oh! No, I want to see. Put that hand back. Ah. Oh, shit. Damn, Wilson. <laughs> Subject accepted. I guess. Okay. So, we did that. But if the police come around, we did not do that. We have an alibi. Okay? Let's just say that. Take all these. Thank you. Okay, so what about that reel that we were told so much about? The one that says the end? That's how we get the ink demon fully out of here, right? Like, I did not get that. I did not receive that memo. You were birthed from the darkest shadow. That voice. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh it's my goodness. What is that? What's the... Oh. charged and I'm going to do this Okay Then we do that again Please tell me I'm doing the right thing Smack it Oh, I need to make you smack this Huh Oh shit Yep, got him All right That simple I get it. Oh, what's up? Oh, it's already the 3 p.m. ass beating? Got you. Got you. Uh. Okay, give me some. Had enough of this nonsense. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Hello? Oh, I guess we're just avoiding this guy for now. Come on, come on, come on. How do I make you come over here? Throw your anchor. Yes. Oh, my goodness. Okay. One more. After this one. Let's go. Alright. Time to turn me up, baby. Nope. I want your souls. I want your souls. What? Ah! I don't even know why I'm doing that. I'm barking like a freaking chihuahua. I'm like... Yay! 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 Okay. Here we go. Come on. Yeah, butthole. Gotcha! Time to die. Wait, what are you doing? Hold on. Give me a second, bud. Give me a second, bud. Hey, you like that? You like that? Oh, he don't like that. He do not like that. No. Okay, so when that gets stuck, just smack him on the ass. Got it. Nope. Okay. I got gotcha. you. I think. I think I'm doing the right thing. Whoa, 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 whoa. What the hell are you doing? Yep. Ah! Oh! Okay. I'm supposed to be hitting you there. What the fuck? No, no freaking way. Got him! 
You can't even notice Wilson's head was right there. Of course it would be. I did not expect that to happen. Thank you. I definitely did not expect that to happen. Um, well, I expected this to happen, actually. Holy crap. <laughs> I'm the ink demon? Nah, come on, man. I mean, I do like these massive forearms, but come on now. What's happening to me? There's always a choice. I know you're in there. Deep behind that evil face. Inside somewhere is my little girl. My Audrey. My greatest creation. I'm scared. I think that's the real that says the I end. Don't know what's happening. The past doesn't define you, nor the present. In the end, all those years ago, Joey Drew finally succeeded. He created life. But Audrey, you're so much more than that. You were his family. His daughter. My daughter. And I love you so very much. Be quiet. Gracious Remember who you are, Audrey. Remember. Your words are wasted. <laughs> the failure of Joey Drew dies I know you're in there. You don't have to this anymore. It's never too late. Just a pencil and a dream. This isn't enough. You have to have heart. No! The future is Licked him like a picked booger. Watch it, watch it. Do it. This is the end.
Press left mouse to smash open doors. Let's go. Oh, yeah. I'm an ink demon with all that ass. He definitely does not skip ass day. What's up? What's up, me? I'm worried about you guys. Why does the ink demon look so much bigger, too? Get off me, you freaking minions. All right. Bop. Let's go. Stop playing with me. Bro, look at these freaking guys. All right. You know what? I had enough of this. Bop. Bop. Okay. They're just not going to stop, are they? Okay. I'm just going to make my way. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. We need to watch that movie. We need to watch that movie like it's a blockbuster film. Like it's the Avengers Endgame. It's really about to be Endgame, though. All right. All right. Stop following me, people. Bop. How do I even know where I'm going? How do I even know what I'm doing? Tommy never lets us down. Audrey, is that you in there? Come on, keep moving. We'll get you through. Tom! Tom! Come on, that's not Tom! Sorry, I forgot to feed you, dude. Look at Tom. He thinks he's him. I'm running. Come on, Tom, pull your weight. Tom, you're supposed to be helping me to smack in my ass. All right, Tom, if that is your real name, bro's not even helping. I told you, he thinks that he's him. Go, 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 go. I got this. Just keep fighting Okay, thank you. Open the door. Mm. Yo, how many of these dudes are there? Can we please get the door open? Man, they are on me, bro. Yo, one of them is literally smacking between my butt cheeks. That is not appropriate. Don't even worry about these bozos. I guess I'm invincible. So they can't really do anything. They're not really like that. Another one Get of these it. freaking doors? Now what? Need some help? Hey, yes. You came. Some battles are worth fighting for. Even a million times. Come on. I found a projector up ahead. Run for it. Alright. Thank you. Not on my watch. Uh, we'll just have to do better next time. Alright. Almost there. There it is. Wait, how did you get there? How come I couldn't have taken that shortcut? told me that just because we're born of darkness doesn't mean we belong to it we're always free to choose that's a good dad my dad always told me if I'm not home by 9 p.m. he's whooping my ass there's a choice to make my father's cartoon world was now mine to rule to watch over and to protect I can make the cycle more bearable for my friends inside. But as for me, I'm the first of my kind. Born of ink, but living in flesh. 
Joey's world is escaping into ours. So, what's next? Who can really say? Wow. So there's going to be a third one. So now the ink world has kind of like trickled into the actual world. And then Audrey is like half ink, half human. And then she can bring in like the ink people to our world. Am I picking up what this game's putting down? But that's what this game was all about, everybody. It was about Audrey's story. Erin Len, amazing job. Very calming voice. I'm glad that she was our protagonist. Lauren Singer as Allison Alice Angel. I have to see who the Ink Demon was. We just gotta see one time. Because that was crazy. Erica Braz Porter. Lanny Manella as Heidi. Show me who the Ink Demon was. Show me. Show me. I need to know. I need it. Sean Crisden as the Ink Demon. Oh, perfection. Dave Rivas as Joey Drew. They were all good. That was actually one of the bright spots of this game. Besides the graphics and just like the smoothness of it, the voice actors were really good. All of them. The Meatly as Henry Stein. Oh, cool. So the creator of this game was uh, Henry. That was good. And Tim Simmons as Wilson. But yeah, everybody. Um, all the other names are going to show up on the screen. Great job to everybody that was involved with the voice acting. With everything. This game was cool. Like, like I said in the beginning of the game, I don't know everything about all the stories. I don't know every single detail, but I was just here for the vibes. And this game was actually a lot of fun to play. It was more fun than when I played the first Bendy. Because the first one, I feel like all the chapters came out so far apart that I started to like lose myself and forgot what happened in the previous chapters. But I want to know what everybody else thought about this game in the comment section down below. I thought this game was a lot of fun to play. It was super freaking scary. The jump scares got me most of the time. Every time it said the ink demon is coming, I jumped out of my seat a little bit. So that was well done in that aspect. But story-wise, I don't know how much it links to the first one or if it even matters. Like, can you play this one and not have to have played the first one in order to understand the story? I guess, right? Because... I feel like I didn't really remember what happened in the first game, but I played the second game and I feel like I didn't miss anything really. Aside from like some backstory from some characters like Alice and this freaking guy Tom that looked like Boris. But yeah, hopefully everybody enjoyed this. Let me know your thoughts on this game in the comment section down below. But yeah, this is going to do it for Benny and the Dark Revival. Hopefully you all enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you give it one big fat like. And tell a friend today that Jay from the Cobb Scouts is that dude.